Yes, so my people, welcome back in continuation with our update. We'll carry take the firm, give on the latest info on as it take the go. In case you have not followed us on our social media handles, what are you waiting for? We did for Instagram, Twitter, and on Facebook. And also, <laughs> we did for TikTok. Waiting to happen now. I don't do for TikTok. They wait for now. Wait, 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 wait. They say for where Lori Ro, for Instagram, when I no agree, follow me. I don't forgive that one. Now I see go open TikTok. Now while they see people, they open. I open. I no even see on that. Not be juju be that. And all of them are dead here. I be on that. They envy my Versace when I they wear me. <laughs> I don't go talk too much. Huh? But they don't go. <laughs> they don't go talk. Say that boy till they talk. Huh? Uh -huh. But waiting carriers come here. Be say, hmm. When I no say the failed fake president of Onkonyaro Grena Sorok awarded a contract of four billion naira to. <laughs> To the to the pipeline megad, you know, say in the creek we have some of an asena creek toad. <laughs> we be asari asari the dock over <laughs> on asena creek toad. Uh -huh. So we am safe. Um, no be me call amo before in go gone the verse. Now see this a kureku of a boy. See they call him and uh, no be me call amo. Uh -huh. They 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 call him creek toad, uh, which is asari dock over. <laughs> on I know him now. Uh -huh. But um, you know, see. No being collect the contract directly. He um he's a partner in crime with uh, Tom Polo. Una no say na Tom Polo be the right man. We didn't give the contract, make it a secure pipeline. We go the lead oil, they go northern part of the country. So now I can the the oil business can they boom, they have been milking, they have been securing the pipeline, they have been discovering the pipelines within they use they do their businesses all this while. Uh -huh. You guys know what I'm talking about. So this is Asari Dokobo for those of you who doesn't know him. Now this picture, uh -huh. in Simon, I know they share. In Simon, I know they share this picture. Anyway, I won't see him. So um, I don't, I don't tell on now. I know they share the picture. So now I make I bring and come out so that you go know the picture. We in the condemn same one I know they share. <laughs> you get the point now. Uh -huh. So know it and know peace. So uh -huh. as he be so remember that Tompolo has um, formed his security men, formed his security men, gate men, no, no be gate man, pipeline guard that have been discovering all the pipes so they know where he did. But based on say they can't pay them, the federal government can't pay them, you know, they have to go and open it. Hey, we are, don't find where the pipe they since uh, you see they have been using it to thief crude oil. They say, hey, these people are really working on Lori Raw. Now them them now they run the matter for the police. Uh -huh, you get the point now. Now I'm be these people, now the security guard, now I'm be these ones. Let me um show you. <sighs> Tantita Security Services. Now, you might be wondering what I'm talking about here. They said that um, the unknown government, <laughs> oh God, <laughs> this story get killed. They said that the UGM has attacked this group of security pipeline megad. I say, eh? Kele mebu wasim, eh? Masia on, yasim, yes. I say, okay, well, how the market they be? They say even one of the speedboats say unknown government, Tifam, take run away, they bagger. They say this thing will not they patrol anyhow for Niger Delta. Say no be waiting. We agree. No be waiting. I suppose they do. You people are supposed to stand firm and talk about your freedom and liberty from slavery. They say for where they must die in slavery. And they can't they do this security mega work now. We make UGM convex. Can't attack them. They say one of their speed boots now where they take they do operation. The UGM hijack them, take them, <laughs> run away. As I, they talk to you, everywhere is on fire. Shooting, they should they, not be small matter. I'll, <laughs> I'll bring you the full details in a jiffy. And then um, when it comes to the Oponko Nyanogre, who gave them the contract, <laughs> you don't vex full all of honor. Where the complaint say that na dollar is hitting um, almost, um, what did they call it, 1,000 naira now, as I speak to you. They say that dollar is hitting 1,000 naira to... Um, one dollar, one thousand naira to one dollar, and these are the things that this up on Konyano guru behind me here. Uh -huh. You know, I don't see them. They, I don't know whether this one are the fake buari or the original one. I know say the original one died, and they brought a fake buari who has been in Asorok eating fried egg and bread. Uh -huh. And going to London to change mask. Although in the London now receiving treatment over the mask when they wear. And more to keep, we keep like this. 
take, take the pretend saying that the original Buhari. Lori Ro, we don't have the original Buhari. I think I've cleared the air on that. Now, look at what he said here. Buhari to Nigerians, if you are hungry, go to the farm. We can feed ourselves. You see, all those inflation, where we say they happen for the country, say no being fault, that we have the capacity to feed ourselves so that he doesn't see hunger in the country. And there's a video I have here which I'm going to show you what our people are passing through, both in Lagos, so in every part of this country, they have been using economic sabotage against the Igbos. But the Igbos have refused to learn. We have refused to learn. And the Minimazurani arrow before we can react. Now that there is time. Chigaria mbuge foduro nihina nchigaria dekwa na lili ebe na la. Now is the time. There is no repentance. There is no let me change the, the hand of time when you don't die. Once you die now, oof, you don't finish. You cannot shake body again. And so life JP. So, and I'm going straight now. So Buhari said that we can produce what we we'll eat. Now let's see. Breaking news. Pipeline surveillance contract. Unknown government have attacked the personnel of Tantita Security Services at Aleibri community. Now, this Aleibri community is in Ekeremo local government area of Bayasa, in Bayasa state. That is where this um, incident took place. Now, what happened? It was reported that a 200 horsepower speedboat was stolen in the process. The, the speedboat was hijacked after the UGM came heavily armed <laughs> and pounced on this uh, Tantita security services. Will be this one when I saw a, when a Tompolo go recruit from uh, uh, where they carry sand before. Now I carry them, come and come put them inside, she, inside that boat. So may they go, they give them small, small guns. May they go, they guard. The distinct. No, we said they hold small guns like that, or they still have BB guns, but the people that came were carrying heavier guns. They, even they are, the boat where they take home the operation, they do like this in one sink, in one, because of the load where they carry. And these are the loads which have been campaigning for. See, give our own ESN load where we say if they carry them, they will need help. For where? Every day, maybe. Near her loot, I say, na money, na money, na money. All right. I know, make I just keep quiet. Shut up, shut up, shut up. Sorry, on a no verse. <laughs> that was a misconception of the tongue, a miscalculation of the tongue is. <laughs> now, they said that the coordinator of the attack unit was able to calm his boys down from going berserk in the community as they investigate to find the culprit. They say that as I speak to you, that the unknown government has escaped to an unknown destination. <laughs> Tantita Security was recently awarded a $4 billion monthly contract by the failed federal government of Fulani to secure the pipelines and reduce, stop, and reduce or stop illegal bunkering and other forms of oil theft. The company is owned by ex-militant government Oweizide Ebemuopolo, popularly known as Tompolo. This incident happened today, being the 3rd of November 2022. As I speak to you now, there is high tension in Bayasa State. The unknown government who came um, and um, carried out this very attack are said to be heavily equipped and very tactical in their operation, and they operated freely. All these uh, boys that uh, um, Tom Polo went and hired, they, they, they couldn't face them. So they hijacked one of the 200 power. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> sorry, oh, sorry, oh, Tom Polo. Sorry, oh, may God not allow them. Instead of you people to speak out. You can see the nonsense going on in this country. For we are not even they interested. Go on, wuna, go take fight to defend yourselves. You left it, and full and criminal terrorists are killing your people at their farms, killing mothers and fathers, brothers and sisters in their farms. Instead, wuna, go join hands to chase away terrorism. Wuna, they, they are the guard pipeline. I don't know where this one now enter. This uh, Asari Dokobo, he don't read for where in day. He don't read. I don't know whether hunger see let and they come out again. Go come out now, come they make noise, carry belly up and down. 
I beg you, may we go straight. I'll be my show now the video. Okay, I will do the video last. I'll be my show now. Um, they say Buari says Nigerians don't have any reason to complain of hunger. They say everything is in, <laughs> is in shape in this country called Zoo. The failed Obanko president, Tenyano Goronima Sorok, Buari fake, says Nigerians can feed themselves if they go back to the various farms across the country. The president, anyone who is really hungry would pick up his tools and head to the farm instead of complaining. He also said the closure of land borders and other policies introduced by his failed administration to guarantee food security have yielded positive outcomes, which we know um, that are failure lies. Lori Ro, FCT Abuja President Muhammad Buhari has said that Nigerians don't have any reason to complain of hunger when the country is blessed with vast land for farming, go to the north. The vast land for farming there has been taken over by Boko Haram. All the people who were doing farms are being kidnapped every day. Most of them are living in IDP camps. And he's telling you to go back to farm. That is to show you the level of... Uh, if I say stupidity now, they will say now president, but make I not use the word stupidity. But the, to show you the level of blockheadedness, that is blockhead, but the brain has been blocked. There's nothing is functioning there. The only thing he understands now is, Kai, bring and popud, I don't chop him. Bring and popud, I don't chop him. I don't chop him. I don't chop him. Now, within this fake president, now you understand. Anything about economy moving you forward, development, all those things have eluded him. Now, they say Buhari made the comment, the fake Buhari made the comment during a recorded interview with Tambari Hausa TV, which aired on Wednesday night, November 2nd. <laughs> recorded interview. He can record a, a, a live interview. They said that while responding to a question on the high rate of hunger in the country, the failed president said anyone who is really hungry would pick up his tools and head to the farm. According to him, the closure of land borders and other policies introduced by his administration to guarantee food security have yielded food, um, positive outcomes. How much is a bag of rice today since uh, you have yielded out good outcomes? How much is dollar to naira today? 1,000. Now, his words, if you are trying to report to me, um, to, if you are trying to report me to Nigerians that I didn't fulfill my promise, let me ask you, when I assumed office, didn't I order the um, closure of the land borders for almost two years? That's a question. I took the decision to stop rice importation and said we should farm, we should farm what we eat or die of hunger. But during the, 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 the daughter's uh, marriage, I've been son, now, foreign rice, they take duamu. They, they cooked foreign rice. And instead of him, stay in the country and take your, your mask off. No way. You must run to London. I think now if you are sick, all of you go fly abroad to go and receive treatment. Stay in the country or die there. If you can't produce what we treat you, die there. You deliver and run. Go UK. Now you are there. Hand over to Sibmanjo. You made that one, Dundee. That Osibanjona is useless. He's of no use to the country. The only time you see Osibanjona is when they want to do trader money, 10,000. 10, they send him like a slave boy. Oh, yeah, go and share 10,000 10, to all the people. And he'll be running kitty kitty, be running kata kata. They've made him handicapped. Instead of to at least even give him the, vi uh, the presidential nomination form, they carry and give Tinubu, we don't, we don't hold, we don't tire. A year failed country. According to him, he said, I said that since we have farmland and God has blessed us with rain, we, we, what season does a Nigerian have to say he's hungry? If you are hungry, go to the farm. Speaking further, the failed president said, I'm aware that floods have ravaged some farmlands this season, but we are still selling rice made in Nigeria and we can feed ourselves. Is that not achievement? Isn't that achievement? We have workers who left their air-conditioned offices and went into farming, and they had bounties harvest, so we are grateful. One of the fight against corruption, the president also said that a lot of successes has been made when reminded that corruption still thrives right under his nose. Buare challenged those with genuine evidence to present it to the anti-graft agencies. <laughs> so that was what he said concerning the hunger issue but let me play you this video uh, it will amaze you what 
uh, Nigerians are doing to Igbo people in the failed contraption. That's why we need Biafra. I'm the president of Alaba International Market Electronics. so i
I have a conducive environment, can we can make business? I had it against anybody. Come on, I have so I can wear a bag and I'm not sure I am with freedom. On your person, why I have a customer, son, I have a lot. I don't have a lot. I 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 have a lot. Ebola <laughs> ndechoro <laughs> All right, so you don't see them. That's what our people are facing in Lagos. That's Alaba International Market. When they hear, I be running, they kill them there. They call army, army couldn't control it. They called police, police couldn't control those Agbero. But if it were to be in the southeast now, if you don't see them, they shoot people up and down. Nigerian army and police. You heard them saying Agbero were shooting up and down. Tinubu boys, you don't see them. But um, they want to, um, oh, lovely baby, baby, baby people. And all of them now, so they go to Mumu. Una want to vote to be, una no go talk out, and want to get permanent freedom. Come open seaport for na area. Na they fab, uh, 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 Alaba, they do slavery. You hear the smell. I beg you, go another news before I change my mind. 